This sinister-looking craft might resemble Darth Vader's Imperial Shuttle in Star Wars but it is actually a high-speed boat that uses its clever design to reduce the risk of seasickness. The vessel, called Ghost, uses two 12 feet, 3.6 meter, winged struts that stand on twin hulls to lift the main craft clear out of the water. This allows the Ghost to reach speeds of 33 knots even when faced with waves of 8 feet high Ghost was developed by US-based Joliet Marine Systems. Founded by entrepreneur Greg Senkov. Ghost is a reconfigurable high speed small water plane area twin hull vessel that delivers significant advantages over alternative vessels in this size class, according to the company's website. It uses a super cavitation effect to reduce the ship's drag coefficient by a factor of 900. The 38 foot long main cabin rests on top of a pair of 12 foot tall struts, which, when moving at speed, prop the cabin above the water like a hydrofoil. The struts swivel at their base, allowing them to be raised and lowered depending on the water depth. While parked, or traveling through shallow waters, they can be extended to the side. In deeper waters, at speeds of 8 knots or higher, they can rotate downward to lift the hull into the air, eliminating the jarring impact of waves. They're sharpened along the leading edge as well to slice through submerged debris. At the other end of each strut, a 62 foot, 18.8 meters. Long tube houses a 2,000 horsepower gas turbine engine spinning two front-mounted propellers. These tubes also eject a pocket of air from the front to generate a super cavitation effect that reduces the ship's drag coefficient by a factor of 900. It's a revolutionary program, said Greg Senkoff, founder and CEO of Joliet Marine Systems. Nothing like this has ever been built by anybody, not even the Navy. The Ghost rides on 12 foot, 3.6 m. Struts connected to engine assembly Sankoff says take advantage of supercavitation, traveling underwater inside a bubble of gas. It is a new application of technology that the inventor insists will make ghost fast. It has so far hit about 38 mph, 61 km per hour, but its creator believes it could approach 60 mph, 97 km per hour, while staying stable even in rough seas. It was announced in December last year that the company will be working with Carmel Technologies, Incorporated, to bring the Ghost technology to Korea. One of these ships would set you back about $10 million. 6.9 million, according to the company website. A squadron of 10 stealth ghosts, carrying torpedoes, missiles or cannons, would wreak havoc on any enemy, it says. Business Insider named the vessel one of the top 19 most game-changing weapons of the 21st century at the end of last year.